I just had a target over here somewhere. Right there. Sounds like a coin. Right near the surface. Right there. Just drop. Yeah, just drop back in there. It's right there. It's a penny. And I can't see if it's a weedy or not because it's so dark. So dark down here, some memorial. Near my detector, so it's even working. Yeah, it's working. I just can't hear. It sounds like iron. I can't really tell for sure because that this train is so loud. Can't tell for sure if it's even deeper, or even something is there. That train is so loud. Yeah, I think it's a pipe. I, I, I don't know. I, I just can't hear. I just can't hear. Red. I just can't hear. I can't hear my detector. Nah, I don't know. I, I can't hear my detector, so I'll just wait until that train goes by. At least it's out of the sun over here, right? That sun is just brutal out there right now. Right there, come on. Right there, do it. Right there. And some, I don't know, I can't see very good. I think it's some water oil. Just a chunk of oil. I'm gonna dig a little deeper hole on this one. Oh, I just made a really weird shaped plug. Right here. Right there. It's in the sidewall, right there. Go easy with it. Get it right there. It's deeper. It's a pull tab right there. Now I can at least hear my detector, so. But I'm in kind of a sh sketchy park too, so. I don't want to wear my headphones in this sketchy park. There's a bunch of people over at the. Over at the cupboard area looking at me. Probably a couple of the locals, right? Hoods. Okay, it's gonna be a pull tab deep. Yep, probably. But I'll go easy with it. Ooh, that's not easy, Jeremy. Right there, pull tab. Ah, oh, that's kind of a plug right there. I was thinking about going over the top lot, but it's kind of sketchy over there right now. I don't really want to go over there. 
some people drinking over there. Some couple. Kind of mysterious people. They were totally looking at me. Totally looking at me. Eyeballing me. Pretty much telling me that, hey, you're in our hood, man. What are you doing? What are you doing? I'm minding my own business. That's what I'm doing. That sounds like a coin. Right there. Oh, it's deeper. It might be on this edge. Kind of sounds like a coin on this edge. Right there. Right there. Yeah. That's a bottle cap. It's a freaking bottle cap, man. It's a bent bottle cap. Those always trick me, man. Those bent bottle caps are killers. Deeper target there. Oh, that sucker is deep, man. I'm going down on this one. It could be something small on the surface, but I think it's a deeper target. <laughs> Just a really faint tone here. This soil is nearly as hot as it was down there. But there is roots up here, so. <laughs> oh, it's deep, man. It is a long ways down there, dude. It's not. It's right freaking there. It is some watered up wire. Yep. Some old copper wire. Sweet, man. Oh, man. I almost don't want to go out in the sun. I just want to stay, stay underneath these trees here for a while. Foil. No, that is not foil. It's deep. The roots aren't too bad here to do so. Right here. Right. Oh man, it just crumbled on me. It just totally fell apart. The roots. It should be right on the surface, right here. Even though it's not hitting it very good. Should be right near the surface. What the heck? Where the heck did this target just go? Oh, there's some fabric right here. So, it's under the fabric, so that's a good thing. It's under that green fabric that they laid for the sod or whatever. Whatever they wanted to do with this. <laughs> there's not really any grass up here anyway. It's deep. That's a good thing. Kind of go easy with it because it's under that sod, that fabric. Yeah. I'm right to it. Just hide out right here. Right there. Should be right in here. Right in there. I'm right to it. I think I got it out already. I did get it out. Come on. Where the heck is the at? Oh, the woods down there are horrible, man. Right there's a coin. It's a nickel. Is it a buffalo? No. I think it's a Jefferson. Yeah, it's a Jefferson. Cool, man. Spanked it out. It was a good target, too. And there's another coin in with it. I think there's another coin in with it. it sounds like something's right on the surface. Right here. Where the heck is it at? Huh. This is probably just a different target. Yeah, it's a different target. It's another coin. Oh, right there. Oh, it's deep. Under the fabric, too. Right there, coin balls popped out. It's a bottle cap. 
It's, oh, it's just wasted. It just crumbled on me. Completely wasted. <clears throat> this one could be a bottle cap too. It's just this hot soil, man. It's hard to tell. This hot soil. It's a big one. It's a bottle cap. It's a pull tab. Half a pull tab right there. That's a killer, man. Probably on this edge or something. But they are still watching me big time. Another bottle cap right here. Is that it right there? It's a pull tab right on the surface. Clean that sound. I go for these targets, man. These mid tones. These clean mid tone targets. Because it could be brains right, right to there. Oh, it's deep. Right there. Oh, man. What's that? It's part of a chain link. It's some lead. It's a fishing loop sinker. Yep. Right there. Of all places to find lead right in a park that's a long way away from any water. It's just weird. I think that's a sprinkler head. Yeah, that's a sprinkler head right there. That beeps, I just dig it, man. I'm just, I just dig it, man, right? I'm not gonna spend 10 or 15 seconds rotating around that target because it only takes me 10 or 15 minutes, 10 or 15 seconds to dig it out, right? And I see a lot of these, a lot of these YouTube um, YouTubers have these videos on how to dig out less trash. Sure, I have made a couple of them, but you know, the time it takes you to use the pinpoint button on pretty much most machines it's on the dais it takes you a long time because the pinpoint button takes two buttons to use the pinpoint button two different buttons i don't know what the reason that was but if you sit there for 10 or 15 seconds you know this is my theory right if you sit there for 10 or 15 seconds and rotate around that target and try to see if it's trash or not and you're just trying to decide you know lifting your coil backing your coil out using the pinpoint button doing a whole bunch of other things you just spent that time to where you can dig that target out right now, get it out of the ground. So next time you come to that spot, you're not gonna be doing the same thing, right? It takes you less time to dig that target out right now so you don't have to come 10 more times over that target, you know, th throughout the years or, you know, if you're hunting in, this, in the same spots, which I really highly suggest. If you just hunt in one spot, you know, that's probably a mistake if you or if you, if you hunt in a spot just one time that's probably a mistake in your park i go to spots and i just beat them up and beat them up and beat them up and finally get down to where the good stuff is at the deep relics the coins the silver all that stuff right the those curb strips where i was digging with my uh, getting all that silver with my simplex i had worked on those curb strip for years for years before i started getting a lot of silver out of them you know and if you decide to you know just dig out the coins and whatnot and you're you're gonna get some good stuff along the way you know getting all the coins but if you're not digging out the trash you're not going to be able to go deeper right and you want to go deeper because you're you want to come to the sites over and over again you know there's spots that i've been hunting on for 15 20 years right and i'm pulling out more stuff every hunt and the only way to get that deeper stuff is if you get that junk out of the surface right there's super trashy areas that i've beat beat up on years and i'm finding these getting good targets like some old jewelry old stuff you know and the time it takes you to rotate around that target and not dig it up you're gonna do that 10 times every time you come to that site you're gonna do that every time 
because it's a target, right? It's an iffy target. If you just dig that thing up right now, you don't have to spend all those other times coming back to that same target and doing the same exact thing, skipping it up. If you skip that target up, you're probably gonna come back and do the same thing and skip that target up again. If you just dig it out right now, get it out of the ground, you won't have to deal with that target next time. Well, thank you for watching. Please subscribe.